In the ancient Roman Empire, there was a brave and fierce gladiator named Marcus. He was known throughout the land for his unmatched strength and skill in the arena. Marcus was born into a family of farmers, but from a young age, he knew that his true calling was to be a warrior. He trained tirelessly to hone his body and mind, and eventually, he was discovered by a local Lanista, a trainer of gladiators. The Lanista saw the potential in Marcus and took him under his wing, training him to become a gladiator. Marcus quickly proved himself to be a formidable opponent in the arena, winning fight after fight and earning the adulation of the crowds. But Marcus was not content to simply be a gladiator, he wanted to be the best. He trained even harder, pushing his body to the brink, and eventually, he became the champion of the arena. Despite his success, Marcus never forgot his humble beginnings. He used his wealth and fame to help the poorer and less fortunate, and he became a beloved figure in the community. As Marcus grew older, he began to think about his legacy and what he wanted to leave behind. He decided to retire from the arena and instead, he began to train the next generation of gladiators. He opened a school for gladiators, where he taught the young men the art of combat and how to be true warriors, not just fighters. He instilled in them the values of honor, courage, and compassion, and many of his students went on to become champions in their own right. Years passed, and Marcus grew old and gray, but his legacy lived on through the gladiators he had trained. They remembered him fondly, and they passed on his teachings to the next generation. In the end, Marcus knew that he had made a difference in the world, and that his name would be remembered long after he was gone. He died peacefully, surrounded by his loved ones, and his spirit lives on in the hearts of all who knew him.